Losing data has become a common problem in daily life as iPhone or iPad users might have no such idea to prevent or handle with the situation. Some of them even don't know why and how they lost their photos, contacts, to SMS and more. It is necessary to talk about iPhone data loss and recover data from iCloud or iTunes backup file and iPhone directly. As you might know, the best bet to ensure data safe is to make a backup of important data regularly. Then you are available to recover iPhone or iPad data from backup files easily and effectively. 1. Recover from iTunes backup file. The top choice for iPhone users to manage iPhone data is iTunes, which you can install on the computer and then transfer data between device and computer without obstacles. It is easy to back up iPhone data to computer with iTunes through Summary, Backup Now under Backup section after connection. Moreover, it enables you can enable Encrypt iPhone if you want to add a password to this backup. The backup file will be saved into the local folder on the computer, you don't need to worry about the data disclosure via internet. Well, how can you recover data from iTunes backup files? You can open iTunes, click Summary, Restore Backup with above mentioned similar steps. Do you think it is annoying if you just want some certain data back like contacts, iMessages, call logs, and others? It is not easy to do this with iTunes as more selective options cannot be provided. It is time to show you a user-friendly and powerful tool to restore iPhone data. Phone Lab iPhone Data Recovery is strongly recommended to you, which is a smart and safe program to recover what you want, how to use. Below is a demonstration with clear instruction for you. Step 1. Download and install the program on your computer and then connect device to this computer and run the phone lab. Tap trust if there is a window pops up on your iPhone screen to allow access. Step 2. Choose iPhone data recovery, recover from iTunes backup file. Step 3. Then you can see all your iTunes backup files on the list. Choose one you think that it contains what you want. Click Start Scan. Step 4. Choose the data you want and check them. You can turn on the button on the top to enable or only display the deleted items feature here. Step 5. Click Recover. How about users like using iCloud rather than iTunes? 2. Recover from iCloud backup file. Similar to iTunes, iCloud is also an Apple way you can use to manage iPhone data. In addition, you don't need a computer to finish the procedure. If you want to back up iPhone with iCloud, just go to Settings, Your Account Name, iCloud. iCloud Backup Enable iCloud Backup and then tap Backup Now. Note, if you are using iOS 10.2 and earlier versions, please go to Settings, iCloud, iCloud Backup. You might have noticed that it doesn't provide options to, to choose data type, so all the data will be backed up or restored during the procedure. That's why you need a selective and functional software to restore data from iCloud data. You should download and install the program on computer, and then... Step 1. Choose Recover from iCloud file from the left panel and log into your iCloud account. If you have turned on two-factor authentication, please go to Apple ID account page to turn it off and turn it again. Step 2. Choose the backup file you want to recover from. Click Start Scan. Step 3. Select the data you want and then click Recover. The last question. How to recover iPhone data if you don't have backup files at all? Below is a satisfying answer for you. 3. Recover from iOS device. It is worth to mention here, the lost data is still stored on your device exactly, but they are invisible to users. Therefore, some iPhone data recoveries help you scan and get these data back directly without backup files. Please keep moving to learn how to. Step 1. Choose iPhone data recovery from the three options, then select Recover from iOS device. Step 2. 
Click Start Scan on Program Interface. Step 3. Then you are allowed to select the type of data you want to recover. Click Scan. Step 4. The scanning result will be listed on the interface after minutes. Some of them can be previewed if you want. You need to find the data you want and check them. Step 5. Click Recover button to get them back. That's all. It is easy to use, right? You can download and have a try now.